Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into Sunny Meadows Restricted on Professional. So, I have to mention, as I'm recording this, I'm trying to beat the storm. Today, we have that hurricane coming in, and we're getting the remnants of it, so... I have to deal with wind and rain today, so hopefully I can get this recorded and uploaded before any power goes out. Now, I have to remember to hit that. That's the most important thing on this map. So, on, me on Restricted, I kind of look around in these rooms just to hope I... Here a ghost, but I never expected to be somewhere in here. I don't know about a hiding spot over there, but looks like we have this official hiding spot open. This one used to be open all the time. Now, I honestly, after Point Hope, I've been having kind of a good time on Sunny Meadows Restricted. I used to not want to play this map. Okay, looks like we're going down. But this map feels so much smaller than like Point Hope or something. And look, it's... Uh, oh, no, this isn't the summoning circle. <laughs> I thought this whole big thing was the summoning circle, but no. It's the monkey paw, actually. So I don't know how useful that's going to be. Maybe we'll have fun with it later. But I'm gonna go <clears throat> downstairs, I guess. Unless the ghost is around here again. I didn't really turn on any lights. I did turn on the breaker, though. I kind of forget that the breaker is always right there. So that's nice about this map. Now, I guess this is a hiding spot, but... It all comes down to if I can even get in here. I expect the ghost to be down here, and look, it's the surgery wing. Let me get maybe a light or two on here. See, this area is... Did I just hear something? This area is nice, but you can't really come in here. So I thought there were lockers in here. You can run in here and hide. But I... Hmm, I swear I thought there were lockers. Maybe it's in another room, but that one's blocked off. Okay, well, I swear I heard something, so maybe you are down this way. Is anyone here? At least this light works. Oh god, wow. As soon as you walk in here, I think this is the room if I had the UV, I'd see all this stuff. Now, if the ghost was in this room, man, the ghost could just do nothing. Is anyone here? So here's the locked door. Now, there's another room back here that I kind of forget about. Here, this is another good hiding spot. But again, you can only get into it if this door doesn't lock first. Alright, I'm gonna walk down this hallway, I guess. Oh wait, no, that was my light turned on. Is anyone here? I really forget about the ambience on this map, like the echo and stuff and the lack of that normal sound you hear. The, the drone, I heard that. Alright, EMF. Help me out here, give me that. Okay, I knew I didn't just crouch over that. Okay, not an Oni. I'm gonna assume that's a picture. I'm gonna take a picture of this. Yeah, monkey paw. Now this looks like it was thrown, but the EMF is gone. And you were throwing other stuff. Maybe it was out here. Okay, well, hmm. We know it's this room by the... This room, whatever you call it, this, uh, screen. Kind of just looking in here. See, this could be a hiding spot. Oh, I think this kind of actually is a hiding spot if you were to stand, like, right here. I might have to try this one. Like, oh, maybe you threw this all the way out here, too. I'm kind of looking around before I just start this investigation. I want to have a hiding spot or something to rely on. Oh, here we go. See, this is... This is what's nice. This is what, like, the other hallway... Remember how I've been complaining? The last few times I've played this map, it's been the same area. But I would hope for more things like that, where there's a hiding spot actually set up in some of these rooms. So now this time, I actually maybe have a way to go. And actually, you can loop the ghost down through here. Again, it's been a while since I've been in this room. But you can loop the ghost in through here and then go out that other way, so maybe this is not too bad of a side to survive on. Okay, I was kind of looking for a bone. Let's stay out of this room if I don't need to be in here. God, this map is insane. <laughs> At least I know that wasn't the ghost. Speaking of the ghost, I see you're doing more stuff. Can you touch this again? Alright, we got four photos. We know where the ghost is. Give us a sign. These noises. Sounds like they're everywhere. I really like this side of the uh, asylum more. That uh, I think it was the female wing, the wing that's up there with the meat room. I don't know, that one doesn't seem to have as many interactable items. This one has, like, more unique items, I feel. Alright, this ghost is gonna just give us the same thing. I'm going to go get more equipment now. 
I need to remember though, there's a potential hiding spot in there. Does this room have a hiding spot? Oh, kinda. Yeah, it does. Wow. See, this side, I like this side so much more. Alright, this is definitely where I use my hiding spot. So if, this, if the ghost sees me go in there, I'm kinda screwed though. But if I smudge out here, can I walk over this? Oh, of course you cannot. Okay, I mean, that's something you just gotta pay attention. You can go this way, I'm sure, but you can't go the other way. That's kind of a unique thing about this hallway. I know they intentionally put garbage in this hallway to block you, but this was at least like a unique way of doing it, so that way you can go this way, but you get blocked going back the other way. Speaking of going back the other way, let's finally go back and get some of that other equipment. Here's that wheelchair. I, I still don't know why they removed the wheelchair event. They said they did it for some reason and it would be replaced with something again in the future, but it really sucks that we're at the point where like stuff is getting removed rather than added to the game. Okay, so it's just sanity and motion sensor. I don't need to worry about getting hunted, but that's the thing. <laughs> I used to say sometimes you don't have to get hunted, but really, and I, I almost, it's almost always going to happen. So in order of that, Let's take out, I want to see the freezing because I noticed it was cold, and then the UV, maybe we'll get in the new UV, but let's go ahead and get a smudge in there just for safety. Also, look at this, we got this new lighter. I forgot that. It said something about them giving more light, but I had noticed that the lighters pretty much never give any light. I mean, hey, maybe this will help us find our way back. I mean, we have the headlight now. Oh yeah, also, I kind of forget these things do burn out, but it said it would last a long time. Okay, getting back in here, I don't really think this ghost is doing much. I'm looking at that sanity, it wasn't. Okay, I'm getting. Wait. Oh, it was it down here? Is the light off or something? Maybe the lights were just always broken right here. I thought there was more light by the room. Maybe it just turned off its own light. Well, first thing. Yeah, I wanted to do that because I noticed it was cold. So, if it's cold pretty quickly, especially with a breaker on. I don't know how the temperatures work on foggy, but it is a foggy weather event. Alright, well, give me the UV. You touch this. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it's on the other side. Okay, let's let this charge, then I need to swap to this. So, okay, the tier 3 is not that bad if it does charge it for a while, which it just seems a lot more easier to drop the glow stick and then take a photo, but I guess it works good enough. I probably will swap back to that glow stick though. But alright, oh, okay, more photos. I did bring in the two, uh, two evidence that would help me here. So... I don't know what I'm even doing. My first one should have been the interaction, then the fingerprint. So I think I could have gotten more there before it touched again, but I'm not worried. I only need two more photos, and we're not getting a super perfect game here. Well, demon, hantu, gin, or mimic. Okay, I gotta go get the ghost orbs. But I'm thinking it's a hantu because of how cold it made it. And it hasn't turned the breaker off, so maybe it's a gin. So EMF5, ghost writing. Spirit box and go oh, ghost orb. Okay. So then, see that's the problem. I'm gonna bring spirit box to make sure it's not mimic. So I need spirit box and ghost orb for sure. Gonna, oh, I don't know what to do about the smudge. I guess I'll just leave the smudge and then maybe bring another. But I wanted to have that in here just in case. I guess I never dropped my camera. Well, maybe this will be the last two photos and then I won't have to worry about that again. Alright, I'm gonna drop that away. So, I guess we just go back and get more equipment here. Except, okay, you really didn't want me to leave, did you? <laughs> Look, I'm gonna come back, alright? Let me make sure I don't have anything. Now, if you start hunting... Please don't hunt, actually. Please don't hunt, please don't hunt, please don't hunt. Oh god, I hate this map. See, now I'm fine. But if it started hunting there, that would have been a big like tactical error on my part. I, I am down in hunt range and then I drop my smudge. Oh my god, that was the event. Okay, so this ghost, look at that. The ghost really probably was right on the line of hunting there. So I do have to get my sanity all the way down to 25. All right, maybe, what did I want? The spirit box and this, but also, I mean, maybe writing, cause that's the only other thing, or dots. I guess we get dots in there. Could it be dots? Oh, it can't be dots. Okay, thank, thank God I looked at that. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna take sanity. And then the ghost will probably drain it pretty quickly back to hunt range. And then, I don't know, I'm gonna have to like use the monkey bar or something to get my sanity down to 25. But this should stop the ghost from hunting. I don't think it's a demon. It would have already hunted if it was a demon. I think it's a haunted, but that's just my guess. 
Maybe it's a gin though, it never turned off the breaker. Alright, I mean, I am glad that I took that medicine, because if I came back, I'd really be probably insta-hunted. So this gives me a moment to try and collect this last evidence. If it's a Mimic, I'm gonna get Spirit Box and the Ghost Orbs here. That's why I had to bring everything for the Mimic as well. But if I get Ghost Orbs and then nothing else, well, oh. I didn't even know you could knock that down. Is that an EMF-5? No. I, that's cool though, I didn't know. I mean, that makes sense. Other stuff can get knocked down, I've just never seen that. Alright, putting book down. I'm gonna talk to you in a minute. But first, I have this weird feeling that ghost orbs are here no matter what. So yeah, that's a haunt tomb, but in actuality, if the ghost talks to us here on the spirit box, are you here? Are you friendly? Are you here? Come on, talk to me. Or at least, are you friendly? Man, I know I'll have the right microphone set. Are you here? I had to click back into the game. I swear to God, that's still not fixed. Are you here? Or maybe they just might really does not recognize my voice. Where are you? Are you friendly? <laughs> okay. I see that you're way out here. Maybe I should grab the... I... Oh my god, what a violent sound. I could tell that was a... a ev event. What do I do? I'm gonna... I have my headlight on. I'm gonna walk away. Because now we're in hunt range. I wanna get this light back on. But is there any... I mean, look at this. There's hiding spots in all these rooms. Is there... I mean, all these spots are usable that's crazy that this wing has this many hiding spots whereas the other one just did not okay maybe maybe you did turn off the breaker okay well huh see we know you're a haunt or a mimic i have the smudge on me let me find that spirit box it's been kind of listening to me are you here are you friendly where are you Are you here? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and say... <laughs> it's not Mimic. We know it's not Jin. I'm gonna go ahead and say from that spirit box, it, we were close enough that it would use it. So this is a Hauntu. No, that means it's gonna be super fast if it's cold, and the breaker's off, so that means everything's getting cold. So I'm going to actually... go back with my smudge, because this ghost is probably draining my sanity. I want to get the breaker back on though, because this ghost is going to be too fast if the breaker's off. Let me get through here. Ah. Oh, see, these lights are all on. It's just because he turned the breaker off. Oh, yeah, okay. See, even though the breaker's here, we do have to go all the way back. But, you know, again, comparing this map to Point Hope, it really feels smaller. I used to think this was like, a, even for Restricted, I used to think this was still, still felt pretty big. But somehow now, I feel like this is pretty small. Okay, is there any ghosts coming over here? Could be hunting. So, motion sensor and then average sanity. Actually, I should have just gone and gotten the motion sensor. So I still need to lower my sanity. And I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. Unless I just ask questions on the monkey paw. And I don't even know how to do that safely. I don't know if there is a way to safely train your sanity without the monkey paw having some chance of screwing you over. Yeah, look at that. We're I'm back down to 50, actually. So I guess I'll just stay in the dark for a bit. This map should drain my sanity pretty quickly. But it was important that I got the breaker back on for a haunt to here. So let's get the motion sensor. I guess I'll get another smudge just for safety. And then that's all the inventory I have. With all the hiding spots though, I'm not worried. And, and if it is, you know, warm, then the haunt will be so slow I don't even need to worry about it. But I do want to test one of these hiding spots in the rooms here. So yeah, now it all comes down to just draining my sanity here. Maybe the ghost will do stuff because I'm already at hunt range. Is that an event? See, I don't really care if the light's off. Oh my, wow, okay. Once again, oh, that was a clipboard that got through thrown. Okay, give me the big light since you're going to turn off the main light. You know, turn off my headlight. So it's actually a good thing that the light's off. 
Now, I don't remember or even know. I don't. I think the Huntu might have some way of draining your sanity faster. But the, now that the breaker's back on, the only room that's going to be cold is the ghost room. Come on, Carla, give us a sign. I mean, the EMF is going off, but somehow you didn't- Oh, there you go. Actually, look at that. The, my breath is cold in here. That's not very good. So let me go figure out what actual hiding spot I want to use. This one's alright, and the light's on in here. But honestly, these ones farther away are probably better. I mean, that one's alright. If I can smudge back here and then run around, then that'll make sure there's definitely no line of sight. I guess I'm gonna try that. Oh my god, the Hauntu though. Alright, so you were kind of fast out here. Oh my god, I hate my life. Oh my god, I really hate my life. I have such a hard time. I, I guess she didn't detect me. I have such a hard time. Oh no, maybe she did. Telling my lights apart now. I'm not used to this headlight. So I turned my headlight off and then I had my other light on. But luckily she didn't detect me or I would already be dead. Look how fast she is though. I guess the breaker wasn't on long enough to really heat up the hallway, so that was actually kind of dangerous. See, she hit a little pocket of warm, I guess, and slowed down. Hunters are pretty cool. You actually don't even need to worry about them if it's a, if the location is warmed up, but I guess Sunny Meadows is so big, it just didn't take, or it was too long to warm up. Well, now all I gotta do is the sanity. I can sit in here in the dark all day, but I'd appreciate it if you did something. Now, I don't want to use the monkey paw, because I'm really afraid it's just going to screw me over and kill me. The safer way of doing this is just kind of hanging out with the ghost, and hoping that some of these interactions or something scare me to low sanity. Give us a sign, Carla. Do another ghost event. Maybe I should stay out here in the hallway. I mean, really, all I have to do is just hang out back here. Uh, okay, headlight off. Here we go again. Jesus Christ. I hate... See? Oh, I almost turned the wrong light back on. If I can get through here. I mean, I'm... I kind of trust the tier 2 smudge. I really want to try the tier 3, though. But... You have no reason to be in here. Come on! Oh, okay, well. I guess I can't blame you for being thorough. <laughs> I mean, maybe if I squeeze a little bit in there. Alright, well, look. If the ghost is going to be that smart to find me. Not every hiding spot is true. Like, the ghost will check hiding spots like that. So even though there was a hundred of them, it was only a matter of time. And also, I probably shouldn't have used the same one. Even though she never really checked this one to begin with, so... Either way, I think that was just kind of down to luck there if you, if you were going to get away. But that's, honestly, that's felt like a true phasmophobia experience. Oh god, game, please don't crash. I like having that. The last few times I've died, it felt like dumb or just like something wrong with the game. But that time, it's like the ghost found me because the ghost will look for you and it will look in hiding spots. And that one probably wasn't like an official hiding spot. See, I don't know how the game even works truly, but even if it's a hiding spot, like and the ghost can still check and find you no matter what. So if you're still here, thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you all next time.